here we are. This is the second in the series of the Kingston HyperX Fury 2400 and 2666 kit. We're running both kits in one machine. And you can see here, one kit's the 2666 kit, running at 15, 17, 17, 35. The other one is the 2400 megahertz kit, and it's supposed to run at 15, 15, 15, 35. We've got both kits in the machine running at 2666, at 15, 17, 17, 35, with an 8 meg run of Super Pi Mod. 1.5. So far everything is running smoothly. It looks like we pulled off a successful overclock and we haven't had to increase the voltage on the 2400 megahertz kit to get it to run at this. So this should be a pretty safe overclock for longevity. What we start worrying about is when we start overclocking past the 1.35V which is the maximum for any given kit, but some of the kits that are rated to run at 1.2V, I don't really like to run those at 1.35 for a long term. So we're coming up on a minute and 30, loop 22, and there you have it. We've got a Kingston HyperX Fury 2400 kit and a Kingston HyperX 2666 in the same machine clock to 2666 15 17 17 35 stable and good job kingston